Hey guys and welcome to the next episode of Oil Rush. So this episode we have burning the trash. A Zeppelin pilot who deserted the Raiders promises to reveal the location of his former LA's camp. He guides a shark through piles of garbage straight to the Raiders shacks. Can with this commander's support is equal to use his tactical skills. Raiders will be caught off guard, but the muddy waters and new bass hold plenty of unpleasant surprises. So we get demoralization and unit armor upgrade. So since we're playing on hard, they're going to give us a bad. Captured Oop. a zeppelin. A pilot is alive and willing to cooperate. He will show us where the raiders' base is located in exchange for his life and barrels of oil. It's been long since I've tried to spot their so-called new Venice in piles of garbage. We can't miss this chance. Go there and finish off raiders. I am ready, sir. Well, well, point this out first. If you watch, the commander doesn't you always follow his lines. From several platforms at once. Send the whole fleet to capture the raiders' platform. So they tell you to send your whole fleet to capture the raiders' platform. You shouldn't. It's a bad idea. Um, mostly because we're playing on hard, and that's not actually gonna get us. I've never felt this sick, even in my severe storms. How the hell does this wobbling piece of garbage fly at all? I think I've got a puke all over the place. And they're also going to counterattack us as well. I think I'll go for their pull Yeah, there they are. So we're going to let them come, defeat them, and then... Oh, see, they're getting ready to attack us here as well. So defeat these guys. We're gonna send him to do that. These guys better help out. And yeah, what's left for me to send? That's a that's not the call. Send out here to defend. <coughs> we need to ask the attack across the seas. It looks like they're. F eh, yeah, it's about. Oh, that fleet was actually going here. They arrive. Oh, we don't want to lose. Oh. This is a big thing. It'll give us more speed and well, let's use the demoralize ability. Oop, the mic. One foot there. I'd rather have um, unit production than oil at this point. Mostly because anglers are gonna totally destroy our towers anyway. Okay, so now we have a chance to counterattack them. We do not want to send our Zeppelin because the Zeppelin must survive. As you can see, the cuts on it there. They're attacking us down here again. I guess we have, at least we have good defenses there. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is all... 50% and 50% of those, and I'll leave a couple guys here. Perfect. These guys arrive just in time to not make it back to defend this one. But I guess that's fine. And 
now what I'll do is send half of those guys there, capture that. But if I leave here, we'll stop capturing, so. That's it, we can just wait for it to capture. And then I'll send these guys here, so they can defend it because I don't have any, any way of building any production. So what I'm doing is I'm leaving them with all the oil production, but taking all the pretty much vehicle production away from them. Also I want to send the rest of my troops here to defend the Zeppelin. Friendly platforms, press zero. Okay. To focus the camera on the least defended platform, press V. <laughs> the least defended platform isn't that all of our platforms, pretty much. So, I think we can capture this platform. <sighs> I hate when it goes into that mode. When you're not want, when you don't want it to go into that mode, yeah, it's kind of good. But see, captured that platform. Let's all go to this platform. Because the thing is, okay, one thing in this strategy is, strategy in this game is getting to places quickly. So this, from this platform, you can get to any other platform very quickly. So this is a key platform. Here there's no one guarding it, so sending one guy there was effective. We are now getting a little bit of... Okay, we don't own this fund fully, so we can no longer build on it until we own it fully. You have found a stack of oil-filled barrels. Sweet. A little more, and we'll have barrels of oil to try to demand it. And just send all that guys. Oh yeah, we don't want to do that. Because I forgot he, he requires 400 oil. Oh well. We'll get uh, the oil here shortly. Oh wait, we even sent our Zeppelin. Which is fine. Is there any, even any guys left here? We'll probably find barrels of oil here since it's the last platform. No, we didn't? Okay. Well, what we can do is just sell our towers. For money. And then we'll have the oil we need. Boom. 400. Zeppelin must survive. Zeppelin survived. Give this Judas his oil. Trader Judas. Got coordinates of the Raiders base. Commander, a minefield is detected. That's why he gave away the location of the base so easily. Most of the units under your command will be wasted to clear the way, but you have to do it. Totally Sir, different. I've got an idea. Let's use their own weapon against them. I can sneak to their shacks on the Zeppelin we've captured. Problem is, its weak guns can't cause any serious damage. Good idea. Don't attack them. Just set the mark for the napalm strike. We'll burn them to ashes. <coughs> so we'll do that. get a new ability here, which is napalm strike. Using a Zeppelin. 
hover over each of the raiders' shacks until napalm strikes. So. If sent separately from the fleet, flying units can reach any platform as they are not limited by available oh, yeah. sea routes. What we want to do is send our zeppelin without any of these units. Because if it's sent with the sea units, it will follow the sea route. If sent alone, it will follow its own route. So. And this is part of the reason you don't want your zeppelin to take a lot of damage during the mission, because it will be harder at this point to complete it. Um, I can't remember if mines are area of effect or they just deal with small groups. We'll see. Can't remember how mines work in this game. I know you can clear them very slowly with troops, and since these guys don't cost us anything, we may as well send them. Napalm Strikes here. Napalm Strikes is just an ability like anything else, but it's one of the more interesting abilities because it lets you actually manipulate the map in a more dynamic way. Uh, most abilities just affect like, like this. Decrease the armor and damage of enemy units, increase your tower's build speed. It doesn't have a great effect on the game in its own sense, it has to be supported in some other way. Actually, good ascent the first one, but here's our minefield. See how it works. I can, like I said, I can't remember really how it works. So, is it just gonna kill big groups? Does it kill one or one? No, each mine kills one unit. So, parts of our force will still make it through. Oh, maybe not. Well, anyway. Hey, a couple main through. I think there are more mines here as well, but we'll always get more men as well, which we can just send them right away. Like, it shoots burning oil all around it, and when these units run into it, they'll take damage. So. Oh, and they pump stuff in yet. is ready for the next strike. Okay, well we can just head back and napalm strike them. Okay. Strike buddy. There we go. Here we'll just destroy them with our troops. I think all the units are destroyed here. Yeah, Zeppelin, Zeppelin gets paid beat now. This way. There, we're pretty much just sending troops to... To capture it. Captured, captured. The Zeppelin in, but probably won't travel. Toronto's probably be the fastest thing. Oh no, the Toronto's. The is ready for the next strike. That won't be the next strike. So yeah, driving through minefields is not the end of the world. Especially because units are free. Go. 
Ash to ash, no sign of threat. Our home waters are secured. It's good to see you cope with the tasks, Kevin. By the way, kill the deserter and get the oil back. It must not be wasted on traitors. Yeah. He did give up the location because there's a minefield, which we ended up just driving right through without any significant loss. I lost the only because of the minefield, but not a big deal. So we will call an episode here, guys, and we will see you for the next one. Later, guys.